olive trees are as close to immortal as it's possible to be. Um, this particular one here, three and a half thousand years old. Um, this one is in, in Crete, uh, which means that this tree was around well before Alexander the Great, well before the Parthenon, um, when Pythagoras was looking at his triangles. This tree was already a thousand years old. There are a few reasons why the olive tree is quite so good at longevity. The first is that they are very, very, very slow growing, which means that they accumulate cellular damage really, really slowly. The second reason is that the oil of these trees isn't just good for humans, it's also really good for the trees. It has these antimicrobial, antifungal properties that, that really protect the tree itself. But the real secret to the immortality of the olive tree actually lies underground. Beneath the surface, there is this ancient root mother, effectively, that can continually send up new shoots, regardless of what is happening up top. It doesn't matter if the, the tree is burnt, if the tree is, is sort of axed down, if you have to shove rocks inside the tree just to, to keep it upright. The bit that you see up top is more like the latest iteration of a really ancient organism. So this tree here, hang on. This is the dead bit. And then look, these new shoots on the side. And that one there. This one's only a thousand years old though. Johnny come lately. That's what you are. New kid on the block. <laughs>